the end of my first series, and it was the, the book where I got to wrap up everything. Everything, it was the final battle, uh, the final um, fight with the Iron Fae, and everything kind of came together. And I re also really like making people cry. <laughs> so it was a lot of fun knowing how much people would cry at the end. So, um, oh, there's a funny story involved with that. So, um, The Iron Queen, you might not know this, The Iron Queen was going to be the last book. Um, I was contracted for three books of the Iron Face series. And The Iron Queen was supposed to be it. There was supposed to be no more after it. And it was supposed to end with Megan and Ash apart because her arc, Megan's arc, well, her story arc was she learns responsibility, she becomes a queen, um, and she learns that there are things greater than herself and her desires. So that was to be her story arc. And to become queen, she has to give up the one thing that she wants the most. And it was beautiful and tragic, and I loved it. And then I get a call from my editor who says, no. <laughs> no, no, you cannot end the book. You cannot end the series this way. Your fans will kill you. Um, so I'm like, but, 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 but sacrifice and responsibility and, and it's beautiful and tragic. She's just like, no, no, no. So, so you can thank my editor for telling me to, or convincing me to write another book. So after, you know, talking to her, I was like, okay, fine, I'll give them their bloody happily ever after. <laughs> so that's where, they are, that's where the Iron Knight came in.